so we have seen the aerobic repression now we will see the anaerobic induction that is in the absence of light there is sorry in the absence of oxygen there is induction of the synthesis of photosynthetic pigment and the reaction that is light harvesting pigment and reaction center pigment so there is induction or more synthesis of the light harvesting pigment and reaction center pigments in the absence of oxygen and this is regulated by a two component system known as reg b and reg a reg b and reg a system this reg b reg a system stimulates the transcription of genes for its light harvesting and photo reaction center complexes under anaerobic incubation condition and how does they regulate it under anaerobic condition a signal is sent to this reg b this reg b acts as a histidine kinase so when reg b receives the signal that the conditions are anaerobic then it undergoes autophosphorylation so the autophosphorylation of this reg b causes its phosphorylation to phosphorylated reg b this phosphorylated reg b then transfers that phosphate to reg a as a result reg a gets phosphorylated this reg a is a response regulator protein so this phosphorylated reg a protein then transfers the signal to the transcriptional activator of the photosynthetic pigment as a result there is synthesis of the light harvesting pigment and the reaction center pigment this synthesis is also regulated by the light that is when the light intensity is decreased there is increased synthesis in photosynthetic pigment now why there is increased synthesis of photosynthetic pigment when light is decreased because if the light intensities are decreased then the more pigments are required to trap the or to receive those that light and therefore the decrease in the light intensity increases the transcription of the genes involved in synthesis of photosynthetic pigments in case of the r capsulatus a gene has been identified that is hvr a gene which codes for hvr a protein this protein is required for the stimulation of transcription when the light intensities are low under when the light intensities are high then the level of this hvr a is reduced and there is reduced synthesis of photosynthetic pigment because light is available so less number of photo, uh, light harvesting pigment can also trap that particular light and it can be used for the photosynthesis okay so <coughs> uh, it there is also a post transcriptional regulation the synthesis of peptides of light harvesting complex 1 increases around four fold in parallel with the number of the b800 b850 bacteriochlorophyll complexes when the light intensity is diminished so and when low light intensities are there there is high synthesis of this light harvesting pigment so this is again the supporting statement the low light grown cell had 1/4 of mrna for the for these peptides so more proteins are present under conditions of less mrna because there is less number of less amount of turnover of this protein under low light when the light in light intensity is high these proteins may get degraded and therefore there is need to synthesize more proteins and hence the turnover number is more but when the light intensities are low these proteins are protected and moreover some additional proteins are synthesized from the mrna okay so this is how the with the help of light and oxygen the this bacterium r capsulatus can regulates the photosynthesis of photosynthetic pigments thank you